big 40, well, I wonder who's the big 40, actually, That's it's double here. here. 40, 40 today, never been kissed. Oh, <laughs> you, oh how are you? Good, thank you. <laughs> I think you're responsible for it all. I think you're responsible for it all, aren't you, this uh, 40 business. <laughs> So I climb these stairs and, and my word, there's a room full of people here. Wonder what's all this about now. <laughs> well, if it's, I think that's that's the man of the moment there. <laughs> Some art on the wall. Honest dollar? Yeah, it cost two dollars. Huh? No, he didn't even know my name is Colin. He didn't Well, everybody's down here. What's what's up down here? What's up, Doc? 
in the kitchen from the leak. And to my lovely children. Oh, yeah. 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 just has a deep, deep love for the Lord and has encouraged um, me and my walk in Madeline and, and um, at times he and Donna have really stood beside us when the, when the going was a bit too tough. And, um, and for that I really, really thank him. And I think you couldn't ask for um, you couldn't ask for a greater friend than one that stands beside you, doesn't put you down because you've, you've got everything wrong, but actually just stands beside you because he's a friend. And, um, and that's the sort of guy Eric is, and I'm sure he's that sort of friend to most of us here, and Donna too. Yes. And um, I've noticed when, when Eric's down, Donna's up and, and, uh, and vice versa, and, and that's the most wonderful thing in, in their relationship. They're uh, very close to you, and what a great family. And um, I just want to thank uh, Eric for being such a great buddy. Thank you. Take a slightly different take. I, you know, it's just um, it's a real joy to me to actually see all all these people here tonight and uh, and to um, to, uh, to realise what a diversity and wonderful creativity and diversity there is in amongst God's people, isn't it? Uh, all of us here. You know, it's, uh, and uh, that's something that I really enjoy. And uh, I, I enjoy being able to see something of Jesus and people who are different from me, um, you know, who and, and yet express uh, the um, yeah express, express something real and genuine and, and, and of God. And there we, can, we can see it in you and God and. Uh, Another, another 
Yeah. You came here at night when the lights were out. <laughs> yeah. What would you like? Uh, yeah, I'm 40 as well. Yeah. I'll call you later. Is that a centimetres or inches? A century is actually. When you think of characteristics, I've had time to think about this because I saw Bill. <laughs> she only does that for the ones she loves. When I think of characteristics and the things that I admire, and uh, it's interesting what you see in people when you get to know them. First impressions for all of us are one thing, but when you walk with somebody or you're around somebody on a consistent basis over a period of time, you begin to see things that you don't see first of all, and. There are certain things that I don't know whether I should say them all. <laughs> probably not. Because I don't want to be stumbling block. <laughs> but I would like to say that um, there are some characteristics in Eric that uh, I, <laughs> yes. I can only emulate. And uh, one of them Sorry. is his absolute disregard for the fear of man. Mm. <laughs> absolute <laughs> fear yes. of God. That's right. I absolutely admire. I think it's because it's probably, you know, my weakness, it's my struggle. And one of the characteristics of having fellowship with Eric and with Donna, with Donna, it's acceptance. She accepts <coughs> and embraces you. And with Eric, it's, it's us before God. And so what? Because God's the one that counts. And his opinion is the issue that counts. And two is... <coughs> The expression of that fear of God is that when he gets something, you know, that um, he believes is is from God, he has no hesitation in sharing it. You know, I go through this whole grid, you know, what are they going to say? What are they going to say? Well, they understand, and he just says it, throws it on the ground, and there it is, and uh, stuff it. <laughs> and uh, I, I really admire that, and I've seen that break barriers, cut to the quick, get to the point, make this straightforward, and I've seen people respond completely differently than I would have thought they would have responded. Because for me, I'm busy sort of safeguarding them and thinking, you know, how you should say that, or how they should understand it, and seeing them respond completely differently to this whole structure that you put in place because you fear what they think and what they feel. Mm. And uh, two, three or five, is I wouldn't want you ever to lose that. Mm. Mm. And I wouldn't want you ever to lose um, your humility in um, the way you approach things. It's a humility growing from inferiority. Okay? Mm. We don't want the inferiority. We want the humility. Mm. Where you're willing to, to say, I don't know, but I'm willing to find out. And I'm wanting to ask the Lord. And I won't want you ever to lose that. Mm. And I see that's promotable. And that's why I'm referring to it now. And I'm not doing this to be good at speech making. I'm doing it because I'm being absolutely honest. Mm. Because he needs to hear it. Mm. So it's out of love for him. Mm. 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 <laughs> to share. Oh, what's your feel? Is that right? I'd love to. <laughs> well, Eric, we've known you for quite a few years now. And um, it's been a real privilege to know you. For many reasons. One, because you honour God. The other is because you're a wonderful father. I know Jesus Christ also demonstrated. And I thank you that you are an example of a godly father for all others in the community. And um, I have the privilege of sharing time with one of your beautiful daughters. And um, I can see the wonderful things you're doing. And I thank God for you. Amen. Thanks, man. Appreciate it, Eric. Is, um, <coughs> Eric and I often have discussions that get heated. Not heated, but <laughs> it's always good for a debate. <laughs> we, have, we have these yeah. really good debates, and you know what? I wouldn't tell them you. I can run past them, I hope. It's normally over the phone. <laughs> I was telling you, Tom, it's one of the few guys I can have a real uh, heart to heart debate with that doesn't damage your relationship at all. Yeah, absolutely. You know, we have absolutely. differences of opinions, but it's great. I mean, um, yeah. But the other thing that comes to mind about you, Eric, is uh, you know, some people have a passion for rugby, 
some people have a passion for money, but you've got a passion for God. Mm-hmm. And um, that, you know, that's the thing. That's the thing that stands out to me and encourages me. You know, mm-hmm. whenever I talk to you, even if you're down, you still got a passion for God. You're still after Him. Mm-hmm. And there's a bit of scripture that talks about um, how deer pants after water, and that's how God wants us to pant after. You know, mm-hmm. that's how God wants to go after Him, mm-hmm. and that's. That's what you remind me of. Mm-hmm. And you know, and Donna, she's here, but you know, the thing that strikes Kay and, often, Kay and I often about Donna and about Eric is purity of heart. You know, it sounds fancy words, but that means a singleness of heart towards your Maker, you know? And I just concur with Madeline about fatherhood and stuff like that. But hey, it's good to know you, man. <laughs> just before I pray for this, two things I think about this household. One is hospitality. Yeah. The other here is your diligence. Every time I turn up here, you have made a wall or a room. <laughs> or a motor car. <laughs> Lord God, I thank you for your wondrous love. As Peter spoke about the diversity of us humans that you've created. We thank you for Eric and Donna and thank you for this family. Thank you for this love. And thank you for the voyage, the trip, the journey of faith that you have begun with them that you've taken them on. I think all of us here in some way have been blessed by that and touched by that. They've served us, they've ministered in very deep places to us, and we're grateful for it. And Lord, I pray that your blessing would be upon Eric and God and the thing that you have called them to give it into, and upon this family, and upon the growth of this family, in the different areas, in the crafts, in the art, in the, in the creative areas. Please bless the work of Eric's hands and protect them in that work. Bless them together as a couple. Mm-hmm. I don't know what ever it is, Lord, that you have in your heart. But give her all good things. Lord, it's going to loose from you to Eric mm-hmm. that blessing that you have for him on this special day as 40th birthday. Mm-hmm. Father God, I loose it to him. Mm-hmm. Oh, Jesus, and bless him. Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 But the, 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 the foundation of it is now is, is, um, is God, you know? And uh, what he's done to, in his fam- family is, is really overwhelming. But also, like, you know, it's pretty showing that um, there's such a diversity of people here that, that um, love the Lord in different ways. And, um, and it's, it's just great that, that we can all come together and share in, uh, our differences. And, um, you know, we are all different, eh? I don't know what I'm saying. Mm. Um, we are all different. And, um, it's a good thing, eh? And I just, uh, I just thank you that I, I've been a part of your life in, in some way, you know? And uh, it's good. And uh, I just thank that you come over and just share this 40th with me. It's, it's a big surprise. And I just thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank my wife for doing it for me, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Just, just one thing. Todd, Todd uh, prayed for Eric, but I wonder if we could just all together thank the Lord for you. Uh, I just, uh, as, we're, as we're standing here, I thought, you know, he's the one who is our focus, yeah. our, our Lord Jesus, and, and we rejoice together in one another, and I just, I felt like it was in my heart, I'd like to just say thank you to him for that. Mm-hmm. Can I do that? Yeah. 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 <clears throat> Father, we just really rejoice yeah. that we can be here together. Yes. Um, thank you for, in your creation out there, you've made all kinds of different flowers, mm-hmm. 
um, all kinds of different trees. Uh, the, your, your world is full and overflowing with abundance and beauty. <coughs> Not, you didn't make a, a, a black and white colored world, it was colored. You, you didn't make just one kind of plant. You made all this diversity and you made us diverse and we want to say thank you and give glory to you tonight mm -hmm. uh, for, for creating, for thinking of Eric mm -hmm. and for what you started and for what you're going to do in him mm -hmm. and we just thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We give you the glory and the praise. Yes. Oh, yes. Thank yes. you. Yes. Yes. We honour you for, for yes. your hand yes. in his life. Yes. Yes. And we yes. want to yes. give thanks back yes. to you. Yes. Oh, thank, you. Thank, thank you. 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 <clears throat> when Dad first um, came into my life, I was, you know, I was sort of, uh, you know, a young chap of about six, seven, or something like that. And, um, you know, he he was a hard man at first. <laughs> 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 oh, get it, get on. Uh, anyway, no, he was, you know, at the time, I, I, you know, you know, being the little guy that I was, I was pretty resentful at that age because I wasn't used to being disciplined. And, and uh, yeah, it was a real pain. Just like getting, because you know, as I sit on that cartoon up there, he's he's got a spanking like a <laughs> locomotive. It's true. <laughs> but you know, that's kind of like yeah, it is. Well, you, you've seen his hands, so you can. But anyway, like now being, you know, now being sixteen and like looking at my life, I, I just want to thank you, Dad, for being disciplining me because I just wouldn't be the guy I would be today but I wouldn't have any I wouldn't be I wouldn't have any sensibility that I'd have or anything like that if you hadn't disciplined me and driven you know I'm there's a lot of scriptures about it. <laughs> to my son. <laughs> All you need to do is give us a big hand. It's not a favourite scripture of mine, but it's true, you know. You spare the rod and you do spoil the child, I guess. And, like, and I'm glad that you did. And I know you did it because you loved me. And, and just like God disciplined us because he loves us too. And, yeah, so thanks a lot. Eh? Mm -hmm. oh, awesome. <laughs> I love you too, man. It's a good time today.